got a sarong from a lovely lady here at Mama Island. We've got our friend back with us. We came for a walk through here yesterday. We're in the middle part of Apo Island on the main kind of street place. And we heard Franco's video keep going off. Like it was really, really loud. There were lights all over it. And there was someone singing like super loud and you could hear it kind of from either end of the island. It was, really, um, it was cool. really, really cool. And there's heaps of cockatoos. Cockatoos? Roosters. <laughs> Roosters. <laughs> I don't know where cockatoos came from. There's heaps of roosters everywhere. I think I think you can hear them. Um, it's just wild. <laughs> Hello. So everyone here. It's just so so lovely. We um we just met this guy as we were walking through town and he told us to come up to this view deck which we completely missed last night when we walked through the middle of town. So we're heading up there now to see what it's like. And we've just passed this beautiful, beautiful lagoon that we missed as well. Um, we walked down here in the dark last night, so we didn't really see anything along the way. What we were doing was scoping out a place to watch the sunrise this morning. But then the thunderstorm cracked down so, so hard that um, when the sun rose this morning, it was still storming and, and we didn't, didn't leave the apartment. But, you know, we got an extra few hours sleep, which we very much needed. But yeah, the people here are just absolute tops. How you going? This is steep. <laughs> So we set off on our walk through town to come back down to the other side of the island and have a look around in the daylight. And as we started walking down the main street of town, um, there was a little stall, a lady running a little stall that had some magnets and sarongs and a few like souvenir t-shirts. So there's an Aussie. And buying souvenirs and things like that from the island directly really helps the island culture and everything survive here um, and continue their way of living. Sorry I'm puffed because we're walking up a really steep set of stairs. Um, and I've been looking for a sarong since like, we got to the Philippines. So I bought this sarong here because 200 pesos which is about three pounds or like five Australian dollars or something like that which is nothing. Um, and then also Jory and I always buy a magnet from like wherever we go. So we got this little cute little magnet. Turtle magnet from Apo Island. Where we've now seen three turtles. Yeah, three turtles. Two yesterday and one today. Um, so yeah, I think it's a really good idea if you can buy a couple of little souvenirs here whilst you're visiting the island to give back a little bit. You can already see it's starting to get absolutely beautiful. Do you hear the dogs going off? Yeah, I know. I wonder why. Oh, it is warm. That's people too. Lots of people. Screaming and yelling. Like a woohoo! Maybe it's at that like meeting thing. I Wait. wonder if that was a cock fight. I don't know. Oh wow. Oh 
old mate locals advice does not disappoint no look at that that's a lagoon and that's the marine sanctuary oh. so you definitely can snorkel out there there's a path out there hello how's the view so good i can never stop doing this it's just just look at the water it's the most beautiful turquoise I've ever seen. And all the coral is there and everything. And then over to that side is a lagoon. And then there's the mountains, like the hills of the island. You got um, Sikior over there. Yeah. Like. Oh, it's just, I just want to live here forever. We're wearing our safety shoes. Safety gongs. Our mate, our mate. He's really sweet, or she? She? She's the sweetest dog. Every time she sees us, she's like, oh, well, where are we walking today? And she just comes with us. And, like, doesn't want anything, just wants to come for a walk. It's just brilliant. Good girl. I used to have these crabs as pets. Did that's, you? Yeah. That's amazing to see one in the wild. All right, don't worry, mate. We'll leave you alone. Neither. I don't know, I don't know many places where you don't even need to go swimming to see the coral and the fish and stuff. But this is one of them. I can actually see one, two, three, four. I think I saw another one before as well. At least four bright blue starfish down there. Yeah, you can, if, you can just see them in the water. From here to that rock there and around there is five blue starfish. Maybe more that I can't see. And I can see all. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I can see all the colourful coral. I can even see like the wavy coral that waves when the um when the water moves. That's amazing. I don't like. Can you think of anywhere else where you can just look down? No, especially from a mountain top. Like yeah, a and, hill. and just see it. So we've just come out to this view. We were just talking about what to do for sunset, and this would be stunning. I mean, I don't think we're going to do it. I think we're going to go back to the to the hotel or to the beach or something. But it would this, be perfect this for lookout sunset. it was so much better than the lighthouse, wasn't it? Yeah. All I ever read about Apple Island was a lighthouse is a nice walk, but there's a lookout walk in the opposite direction of the lighthouse. Do it. <laughs> just do it. It's amazing. So this is the lookout, there's no deck here, there's all the stuff like, looks like they were once building one or maybe they're going to, but you just can't fault the view, absolutely stunning. What do you think? There's a beach there too. Yeah, there, is. there is a beach there that no tourists go to. If you come here it might be worth might be worth doing the lookout walk first and trying to find a way to get to that beach. Because if you can go there, you've got a beach all on your own. This is what life is made for. And 
and this is as far as it goes right on the point of Apo Island on the tail of the turtle if you will see it so there is a turtle just swimming out in front of us that we can see I don't know if you can see it but fuck I love this island just Oh, Apo Island. Apo Island means Turtle Island, by the way. Yeah, and we've seen Obviously. four turtles. Seen four turtles now, two while snorkeling, one while diving, and one just while walking. Up and above. <laughs> the island, when you come to it by boat, looks like a turtle as well. Yeah, it really does. Everything about this place is absolutely incredible and like a must visit. I think we've said that a million times, but we can't say it enough. So I used to go on bushwalks very much like this at a little place I grew up in in New South Wales called Finglehead. I'd take my dog and we would walk on tracks very, sim very, very similar along the headland. And at the moment this is just reminding me of home so much, which is lovely because Malika and I haven't been home in over two years now. So we're very much missing it and every time we get a sense of nostalgia like mangoes or tropical flowers or bush walks like this with my dog oh, it's just so so lovely travel is amazing you should definitely do it everyone but home's pretty amazing too and we really miss it and we're really looking forward to getting home and seeing our family the Haviana brand name mountain climbing thongs. Perfect for this type of activity. which is the opposite side to where you normally swim and snorkel and stuff. You go, you keep following the path down past the lookout location to get here. Quite beautiful. So this is that lagoon that you can see from the top. This place is just magic. Don't know what they are. Hello. 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 <laughs> Look how beautiful you think it's like. Our friend's still here. So. We're just at dinner and they took one look at Jory, sweating, decided to put on a fan for him. <laughs> I've had pina coladas before, but never a mango colada. It's the way to go. It's beautiful. It's like a mango smoothie. Yes. Thank you. What are you having now as well? <laughs> this is t Tanjue rum. They've got signs for it everywhere. I really wanted to try it. It's only what, 20 pesos, which is 30p or 60 cents Australian. <laughs> it's all right. Jaws made a friend. <laughs> Hey, 
having breakfast now we forgot to do a sign off last night because we had a few too many drinks <laughs> um or well, actually we did do a sign off but it was dark and we were very 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 drunk so <laughs> at the end of yesterday we had a look at the marine sanctuary and then we went swimming out the front of the hotel at sunset which was really nice and then just came up and had dinner and had a bit of a jam and some beers with a few of the local guys it was it was lovely it's really nice yeah anyway hope you like the video and um please subscribe to our channel because it really helps us out and we'll see you in the next video Bye. we, we love, love you apple, apple island, island.